This video is sponsored by PDS Debt. Getting into debt can happen fast and the system is designed to make getting out of it nearly impossible. The anxiety and the stress can be overwhelming. I get that, but I'm here to tell you there's a way out. If you're paying on time every single month and those numbers just are not going down like they should be, it's time to change how you're approaching your debt and PDS Debt can help. They have customized options for anyone struggling with personal loans, credit cards, collections, or medical bills. There is no minimum credit score and anyone with $10,000 or more in eligible debt will qualify. PDS Debt can help you roll all of your debt into one monthly low interest payment, making it easier to pay off your debt in a fraction of the time, saving you thousands in interest and fees. It really is so easy. All you need to do is hop on their website, answer a few questions, and fill in your information. In less than a minute, you'll have a free quote customized to your situation with no obligations. It really is no surprise that they are a top rated company on Google and have an A plus rating on Better Business Bureau. They truly care about helping you get out of debt. PDS Debt is offering a free debt analysis. It only takes 30 seconds. Head over to pdsdebt.com slash Matt Carricker to get your free debt assessment today. Now let's go turn off the sun. Hey, all right, today we are checking people in at the gates here. Is this guy just a camper? Just brought 500 gallons of water? <laughs> we told him there are no hookups. He's like, I got you. Uh, we got everybody showing up. Uh, how many people are like tent camping versus like RV camping? It's a pretty good, it's a pretty even spread, I think. A little bit of both? Yeah. Okay, cool. So I'm, uh, we're just doing a little greeting and uh, then we'll go see what the fields look like full of people, which is crazy because that has not happened in decades. Y'all ready to party? Yep. Sweet. I'm excited y'all are here. <laughs> Dang, look at those guys. All right, we got three coming in. I think we're actually going to go down to the pasture right now and try out the food trucks. But looks like they got them all figured out here. They're checking everybody in. Dude, there's four. There's four? Four of them trying to come in right now. Jeez. We should get a bigger gate. It's a party. You want to go down to the other tent and I can set I think it I down? nailed it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> The gang is here. <laughs> hey guys, Yo, welcome. Wow. Matt. Party's here. <laughs> Dober hey. Johnston. Hey Dober, how are you? Good, dude. Good to see you. I'm doing well. This is a friend of my mom's. <laughs> you went to high school with her, right? I went to elementary school with her. I <laughs> Sweet. met her in the first grade. So you know all the all the dirt on my mom. Ever been on <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> well, look at you checked Dilbert. in, Delbert. Okay. <laughs> Down when I got here. <laughs> what the heck happened here? I swear I didn't do it. It was Mikey. <laughs> it was Mikey. Where, where are we at on the tour, Cameron? So where we're at is we started talking about they were asking about the fireplace. Yeah. And I said uh, it's one of the many things that Robert's annoyed yeah. with me about because I really wanted to keep it, and I know you wanted to keep it. And his problem was the roof lines and just how everything looks aesthetically. Um, and so basically we can keep it if we just kind of lop it off at the top and this won't be functioning, but we could put candles in there and it's beautiful and it's original, so. Check out this awesome road. We got it ready just for the event. All smoothed out, nice and wide. So beautiful. Canyon we made with all the explosions. What's up guys? Much. What's up, man? Guys. How are you? Good. I'm Connor. Nice to meet you, Connor. Matt. Nice to meet you, man. Well, where's, where's your spot at? Uh, right over here. Just parked a couple hours, like an hour ago. Heck yeah, man. Yeah. Well, thank you for coming. Yeah, of course. We'll be here okay. all day. So we're just making around saying hey to everybody. Awesome. That's great. Hoping for good weather. Yes, sir. Me too. You came in a cuck fee? Yes. Love it, dude. Thank That's you. That's awesome. That is, you got a whole setup. You got the manliest camp set up. <laughs> Thanks, man. That's what a CUCV. It's, it's called a cuck fee. Hey, guys. You got the nice spot on the end all by yourself? Yep. Perfect. Thank y'all for coming. Yeah, otherwise it won't go. So this will turn it on. And 
Not like a gas motor. Yeah. It'll, it'll get with it. So. It'll like pull wheelie right away. So no clutch. No clutch. Back brake, front brake. Front? Yeah. Back and no shifting? No shifting. Okay. Just twist the throttle. Like yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna hurt myself on this thing. That's so cool. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna let you do it before I break anything. <laughs> that's awesome though, that's perfect right here. Yeah, that's cool. Really cool. This is crazy. We came up to the top floor, one of our three-story buildings that overlooks the pasture. This is not, like all these spots are gonna be full. So this is, pasture's half full right now. So um, some people are still coming later today. Some people are coming in the middle of the night. Some people are coming tomorrow. This pasture will be full, but it's crazy just seeing it like this. It's always been just me or just me and the, you know, the crew here. Like there's been a max of five people in a pasture at a time. And it's weird seeing it just full and alive again. What's even weirder thing about it is like this building someday will be full and alive. It's so weird. Not empty. I'm anyway, not done. I'm happy. My heart is full and alive right now. Clint's thankfully is still full and alive too. Yeah, it's yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
But thank you guys so much. This is our first event. I know a lot of you guys didn't come because it was going to be great. You just came to support, which is so cool. So thank you guys so much. We're going to try our best to make it super fun for you guys. Um, I want to also say thanks to all the staff who's helped me put this thing on. It wasn't just all me. That's what I make it look like in the videos. It's just me. We got a good team behind us. Uh, appreciate my cameraman, all my staff over here. Thank you guys, Cameron. Thank you guys for making this event happen. Uh, I made a joke in a video about Willie Nelson coming out. I'll be honest, that's my goal someday is to have Willie Nelson. But we got the next best thing. We got Stucco Man over here who looks like a younger, stronger Willie Nelson. And he sounds amazing. And he's going to rock out for the next few hours for you guys. Thank you guys so much. Y'all have a great time. I'll be here the next couple of days. Plenty of time to hang out. Come talk to me. Let's take pictures. And uh, let's have a really awesome Booty Snapple Fest. And uh, also, if you want to see our gun range, we're going to put that open on the way out. Uh, Tuesday, when you're leaving, we're going to have a time you guys can drive out on your way out and see our gun range. We don't have uh, the staff to do any shooting out there. But you guys can go see it. Be careful uh, driving because we've got kind of a skinny road. But we'll make it happen. Thank you guys so much for being here. I love you. And I'll see you for the next couple days. So good. And, and it's the acoustics of that stage, man. Me, me, somebody. Yeah. I'm over the moon happy right now. This is like the perfect night. We got people all just hanging out on the lawn, watching. What are we got next best thing to Willie right here. Why do I lift my silver? And he actually sounds exactly like Willie somehow. The dude's good. Sucko man. He's so good. Friggin' best night of my life. All the cave boys are here. Willie is still playing up there at the stage, but the cave boys have something they're rigging up here. I'll link all them in the description below. I still can't figure out what y'all are about to do. Is Alex about to die? Maybe. Yeah. In a way, probably. Oh, is he gonna come? He gonna pull himself all the way up here. Up in air and uh, this is a bad idea. He's just gonna hit the ground right there. Bah! That has happened already. <laughs> Jeez. Oh my gosh. Yep, I'm not doing that. <laughs> He's doing the Toby Keith and the Willie Nelson parts of that song. This guy. I've signed a lot of weird things. No one's ever asked me to sign a kitchen before. You should sign the door? Yeah, yeah, sign the door, man. How big? How small? John Hancock, as man. As large as you'd like. You're the first of many, I hope. <laughs> but, but possibly the last of all of them. <laughs> so, you know. All right. I signed a kitchen. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Appreciate yeah, it. Yeah. <laughs> and David. It took me a long time to figure out who David was. I still don't know who David is. Has he been with you since the beginning, like holding the camera the whole time? He's been with me for a few years. Two and a half years. Yep. Two and a half long yeah, years. He was making those flips and stuff at the beginning. Yeah. You know? <laughs> Nailed it. Uh, the Oki Lemonade crew wants me to sign their dog. It's, his name's Sammy. 
He's super cute. Where do you want me to sign him? On his paw? I don't know if you'll see it very well, but you can still sign him. <laughs> oh, Sammy, I'm sorry. All right, I don't... You know what? We'll call it good. Here, I'll put a dot on his ear. There you go. That's my signature. <laughs> I signed Sammy. <laughs> Pretty cool. Uh, we have nearly everyone here now. Day two, um, still early morning, everybody's just kind of getting up. But, you know, there's a couple spots still open. All these spots sold, so I see, I see like four spots open right now. So those people will be coming in today. And somehow the weather is holding off. It's still been saying it's gonna rain, but now I think it's not gonna rain until this afternoon, like later afternoon. So we may be able to see an eclipse today. The uh, you can see a little bit of blue sky. Like, look at that. There's blue sky up there. So we're hoping, keeping our fingers crossed, that hopefully we can actually see the eclipse today. The weather, temperature-wise, has been perfect. Yesterday, it was perfect all day long. It was warm enough to go in the river, but it wasn't too hot to where you had to. Like, people were just chilling in the shade, and man, everyone's had, seems like it's had a great time. I talked to a few people today. One guy stopped me and he was like, Matt, you under-promised and over-delivered. And I was like, that's what I'm talking about. Like, I love hearing that kind of stuff. Two different people told us uh, this morning, they just like came up to us and said, this is way better than we thought it was gonna be. Like, it's more than we expected. And they like thanked us. So that's awesome. I'm over the moon. I kind of forgot to really film much last night because I just like sat out watching Willie, Willie Nelson, just enjoying myself. And it was awesome. Like my family came out, all my friends came out. We just hung out and watched a concert at the resort for the first time in 20 years. So good. So to everyone who is here, thank you. You guys did not come out because we were gonna have like such a good event that you couldn't get other places. You came out to support what we're trying to do here, to support me, to support this place. Greatly appreciate it. Everybody who's watching from home, supporting from home, thank you too. We, uh, we have a tour going around right now. We just went and walked with them a little bit and they're checking out all the buildings. It's just cool, like this place is alive. There's music playing. It's 10 o'clock in the morning right now. We just got music playing down there. We got a band coming in this afternoon again, a different band. So good. We need to do more of these. Oh, look at me, I'm, I'm Mikey. Oh, oh, my hair's so, so luscious and long and beautiful. And I don't got hair. I don't got hair, Mikey. David is fire. Yeah, right. What do you even do? <laughs> Thank you for highlighting the existential crisis I live with every single day that I wake up. I just ask myself, Anyways, what is this for? What am I really good at? Is there a point to any of this? Did you fire David? Yes. Well, what are you still doing here? You like a Jenna too. Okay. Just me and <laughs> So I guess uh, Mikey's the uh, chaos. What is she? Chaos coordinator. That's Jenna's Ooh. official title. Commits chaos. Chaos. Man, if, if Mikey was the chaos coordinator, we are... <laughs> the viewers are in for a treat. <laughs> it's about to get way wilder here. And see. Look at this sunshine. We have about two and a half hours until the eclipse. Um, like one and a half hour until it starts, but two and a half until it is like full on. So keeping our fingers crossed that it stays all sunny and beautiful like this. But there is a storm coming in this afternoon. So we'll see. That guy's got the right idea. It's tubing time. It's been 30 minutes since our update. There's still some blue, but it's getting cloudier. We may not see it. It's still gonna get dark, and the more clouds that are out there, the darker it's going to get. But I really wanted to see the sun and moon crossing with my glasses on. We'll see.
10 minutes till partial starts. All right, you can't see the sun very well unless we look through these glasses. And then you can actually cut, this camera doesn't do it. There you go, you can see the sun through the glasses. What do you got, what do you got? So this is a Mylar filter for cameras. Yeah? So it's, car it's made out of cardboard, but it's got the same material that the uh, Crazy, and so that'll just fold around you your lens. It, or, yeah, exactly, it's universal, so I can put it on. I have the, the long lens for, for uh, taking pictures, but you just. So the camera's eye doesn't get hurt. Yeah, because if you, you can't, shouldn't point the camera straight at the sun. What? That's what I was literally just doing with this one. Don't do it for too long. I'm gonna do whatever I want. All right. <laughs> That's not how it works. I can not see anything. <laughs> the eclipse we has officially started. We have like an hour of the moon kind of barely passing in front of the sun uh, until it finally we just got totally it. covers it. I can't see anything right now. We do have clouds. You can see through it with the glasses, but we can't see the sun or the moon actually eclipsing it yet. We'll see. It is eclipsing. It actually isn't working very good making you guys look through this, but it is, it is working. I can see the moon. Mikey's done. All right, we need to get one of those electric bikes. It's called a Suron electric dirt bike, and we have to find one. We need it for the ranch. I'm not a big I think I can hit him with a football. Okay, we have about 25 minutes until totality. We can't see the sun anymore. It is behind clouds. There's maybe some thinner stuff over there coming. At this rate, we're not gonna need our eclipse glasses at all, which is a bummer. You can tell it's already getting darker out here because probably half, over half the sun is covered right now, but mm, can't see it. On the bright side, it is not a thunderstorm right now. The weather's great. It's getting darker, it's getting cooler, but I can't see it. Hey Matt, huh. what happened right there? Uh, a bird poured Miller Light on me. Give me that. <laughs> I told them, I thought he was you actually. They both, wow. both look the same. Really <laughs> tanned. That got weird. Do we look the same? Flip it around. What do you guys okay, think? Okay, yeah. We, Down in the comments. Say. Down in the comments, yeah. I can never mm -hmm. tell which is which. Mm -hmm. Like, I, is that David? Is it Mikey? Is it Jenna? I don't know. Be Jenna. <laughs> I, yeah. Same, same. But, but same. different. But different. But different. <laughs> the ISO is like really, it's, it's auto adjusting. Confused. So it's like, I don't know what that means. Clearly. International What do you mean? Otto's your favorite. Optrician. Optrician. Yep. That's space about eye stuff. Yeah. That makes space, sense. Space International space. Yeah. Optometrist. People in the space yep. station, you yeah. know, they need contacts and too. That's so they, like, do the it's camera it's International Standardization Organization. Oh, yeah. wow. I, was, I yeah. didn't say organization. For. I that's said it. international. Yeah. Anyway. It's definitely getting darker out here. The sun came out. We can see it. Actually, the camera's not showing it, but you can actually see the moon about to eclipse it. We're like 10 minutes out now. Blind now. Are you blind? <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> yeah, the dogs are all barking weird. They're freaking out. You're I'm about blind. to turn off the sun. Like, like, there's Don't the take your chance. So cool. You can't see it with the glasses on. Yeah. It's like, with the clouds, you can't see it with the glasses on. It is like 90% covered right now. Also, my camera's going to adjust and make it look not that dark. Dude, it might be perfect. This is so good. This is this is funny. <laughs> this is very Everybody's funny. cheering when the when the cloud goes away. Everybody cheers when it comes back. Everyone's like, "Oh, it's getting darker. It's happening." Mikey said that when the sun goes out and it's pitch black, he's going to run as fast and as far as he can until the sun comes back and then see where he ends up. Yeah. Which way are you going? I don't know. Now that I'm thinking about it, I might try to make it to one of those buildings. Okay, so you can get to it? Yeah. All right. You have what? Is it 10 Three minutes? Three and a half minutes. Three and a half minutes, that's right. Oh, I can make it. Three and a half minutes. I'll make so it. Go you need to go up there and yell from the top. Yeah. And I'll we'll time it. it. I'll make it. Okay. I think. I think I'll make it. No. Uh, you have jeans okay, on. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna make it now. <laughs> Doubt me. It's getting darker out here. This is cool. The last time a total solar eclipse happened in this county was like, I think it was hundreds of years ago. So this is pretty cool. And then there's another one happening, it's not gonna happen anywhere else in the US for like 20 years. This is the last time we're gonna be able to see an eclipse. And unfortunately, we're not really gonna be able to see it. It's up there behind those clouds now, they got thick again. They kind of roll in thick and thin and thick and thin. We'll see. Ooh, it's getting dark. You really gonna run up that hill? I'm starting to realize how far that actually is. That's far, is. <laughs> and it's up a hill. You run that way. Up oh, a dude, steep hill. Can you just go straight? I mean, yeah. it looks like you could go. You can. You can go up it. You can go straight up it. It's gonna be dark. <laughs> <laughs> it won't be dark, dark. Yeah, you gotta. 
Now you have, um, I think, four minutes until totality. Okay. And then you can run. That's better yeah, start stretching. Chug that, chug that Miller. Yeah. Rule 17, you gotta limber up. <laughs> I heard some popping just yeah. now. <laughs> this is it. It's happening. We had this camera all ready to catch it. We had solar filter and everything, and all these cameras ready, and it's gone. It is dark out here. It's this camera's adjusting. It's actually darker than this looks, but. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I think we missed it. It's actually 132. Mikey, one minute out. You it's ready? Like, it just got a lot darker. Yeah, it's getting dark fast now. Mikey's he's getting ready. It's 132. This is it. It's it. It's getting dark right now. Go now. 100%. This is it. You got you got to 136. You got to sound off. I'm going to make it. You got to sound off. Go Mikey, go. Go Mikey, go. Dude, it just got so dark. Holy cow! This is weird. Oh, my camera makes it look oh, so it's light. Darker. Dude, that's trippy. Oh my gosh. Dude, this is that's weird. Crazy. It feels like I'm passing out. It's just getting dark. It's slowly going down. It happens Whoa. way faster, Matt. When, it, when, the when, you, when you pass out? <laughs> Dude, it's still getting darker. Holy cow. The settings since yeah. the last time? Yeah. And like. Oh, yours shows what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Oh, yours shows what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Holy cow. Yeah! Woo! We did it! <laughs> and for my next act, I'm gonna turn on the sun. Dude, it's so dark! Holy cow. I mean, you can see right there. See those lights lighting up over there? It shows how. It just got so freaking dark. This is crazy. This Can is you see me? Barely. I mean, this is crazy. Dude, Mikey's gonna die running with this. Mikey's gonna trip on everything. Dude, this would trip you out back in the old days when you didn't know what was happening. That is insane. I'm traveling across the world to every eclipse forever now. This is the best thing ever. Oh, your necklaces are glowing. Wow. Can you see me now? <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. I'm, yeah, I'm adjusting now, but it's still. It's Holy. Like, and it's colder. It's maxed out. It's right. way colder. I'm going to the river. I want to see if, if the frogs are making noise. Because that would be really cool. They don't make any noise during the day. Oh, yeah, you can hear them. Well, that's crickets. Crazy. I don't hear frogs yet. Man, okay, you can see how dark it is. You can't see anything down there. And it's 1.30 in the afternoon right now. Holy cow, this is so cool. I feel like I need a whisper so I don't ruin it. We did it! Yeah! <laughs> That was so cool. Mikey made it. Mikey made it. Mikey's up there? Mikey! <laughs> Mikey made it. In half the time, he could probably make it back. He's still got two minutes to come back. He's so limber. Go catch him, Clint. You can do it. No way. Holy cow. All right, I'll turn it on in just a sec. What? If this happened and you didn't know, and you're, it's back in the old days, you just assume it's over. Yeah. It's over. Yeah, sure. we're, we're done. Yeah. I mean, people still think that. Like, yeah, that's probably true. There are a lot of people out there. Like, it's good to know that we've advanced so far in society, but we're still pretty dumb. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. Look, it's starting to. Is it brightening up? It's starting to light. It's starting to get lighter. Yeah. Crazy. Since the camera is auto adjusting, this is the best way to judge. Oh, like, look, look. whoa, oh, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, that's <so> buddy. Cool. <laughs> oh man, that's coming out fast. Mikey's just gonna pop up all winded in a second. <laughs> cool, that is nuts. A little bitty sliver of the sun coming out now. Same thing tomorrow, let's do it again. Run it back. Do over. <laughs> do over. <laughs> you guys notice a new grass stain on Mikey's left knee? You fell down? No, 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 that was whenever me attacked the rider. Oh. <laughs> How was it? The second part, 
my god. Vernon, you made it with like two minutes to spare. Yeah, I was just chilling there, but the whole time I was... <laughs> yeah, you had a lot of time. I was like, I slammed one of those beers. Man, like a minute after you left, it got so dark. It got dark, and I got... <laughs> I got scared I couldn't see through the trees. Yeah, I was like, man, I didn't know it was going to be that dark, and Mikey's running through the woods right now. <laughs> but that hill, that incline burns. <laughs> Faster, don't be a wuss. That's a hole. Stand up straight, stand up straight. It's about an hour after uh, the eclipse happened, and it's starting to rain. It's sprinkling now. There are thunderstorms planned for later in the afternoon. But we'll see what happens. Baby! She's so tired. I made a joke in a video about the best barbecue in Texas. It got dark. We got it. Look, hey, that's my. That, don't eat that. Dang it. I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed <laughs> that it took this long for y'all to figure out this hill is awesome. If I die, you get the ranch, bud. Yeah! This is a bad idea. I don't think this is a good idea. We shouldn't do this, but they're gonna do it anyway. It's a smart idea. It's a very smart idea. <laughs> he just wants a ranch. <laughs> You Mikey barely won. Everybody look away from Matt's butt real These quick. are my church pants. Not no more. <laughs> Not no more. Well, now they're holy. Now they're holy. <laughs> they're holy jeans. They're, they're built for church. Go! If you fall, you're only gonna hit rocks and asphalt here. Like this is the literal worst place to do it on the entire property. They were doing it over there. I know, they were doing yeah, it down by the river the where river. it's soft dirt and you Grass go into water. And, yeah, that's fine. But here it's like, this is just an asphalt road covered in rocks. But it's steeper. Giddy up. I'm gonna have to buy new jeans. Hey, the higher the risk, the higher the reward. Man. That's true, and they are so rewarded. That's not gonna happen. Jenna, Jenna, I'll get hurt, y'all. Y'all don't know that. about the chaos coordinator, I guess. She's gonna definitely say no. <laughs> the band's starting in 30 minutes, so this is what we're doing until then. Just racing. Actually, there's moms doing it now, so getting crazy. Let's hear it for moms! For the record, this mom I think is the one who brought these things, so if she tears up her knees, it's on her. Okay? I think she signed a waiver. Did she sign a waiver? Listen, for the record, everyone signed waivers. Y'all should not do this! <laughs> yeah! I gotta get out of here. I do not, officially, I don't condone this. But I'm not gonna get mad if y'all keep doing it. Wasn't me! Everyone run! Go, go, go! He's gonna die! We hate 5 0. Wait, I hired that guy. And he's awesome. blue this sky is. I mean, we got a sunset on the pasture over here. Why could it not have been like this during the eclipse a few hours ago? But overall, we had perfect weather the entire event. It has been so freaking good. Couldn't have asked for a whole lot more. During the eclipse, a little more blue would have been good. We still get to see it. It still went pitch black. It was crazy. And now we're just chilling, listening to Brett Mullen's band with the sun going down in the sky.
Did, did this kid sign a waiver? Did he sign a did he sign a waiver? Respect, kid. My lawyer will be so pissed at me right now. I hope he doesn't watch this video. an idea. We get kayak and we do races. But like way up river, like some other town, we start there and we end here at the resort. You in? The thing is you gotta film it. So so you gotta like drive bridge to bridge and, and make sure you see me winning it. Can I have a speedboat? Maybe. And if I'm not winning it, you just don't film the guys in front of me and you show me coming past the bridge first. It's like how on Demo Ranch when you miss the target and we just edit that out. I never miss, for one thing. Oh. Just film this big dude doing it. You can do that. You're too big. Going down there. I'm gonna do it. Oh God. I don't like this. I don't like it either. I don't want to watch. I'm not watching. Is that Jack Black? It looks kind of like Jack Black. Oh my God, I think that's Jack Black. No, that's Black Jack. I love you in Tenacious D. Yeah, Tenacious D is awesome, brother. Woo, pick a destiny. Yeah. That's not a small rock either. He's very proud of his rock. That dog is either real hardcore or real dumb. That's probably going to be the most famous part of the video. No, nah, he's a rock and roller. Living the dream. I mean, Here we go. In the Guadalupe <laughs> River. Best worthy guy I know. Get that out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I bet Jenna cannot catch a football. You throw it to her. Do uh, it. Uh, oh! Oh! <laughs> it doesn't even hurt when this she bites This is why you me. never got anything done when we had the raccoon. <laughs> I know. I would let it bite my face too. I would. I would. Should have brought river clothes. Those are your church pants. Yeah, my church, but I had to clean them. They were getting all dusty. That's true. You gotta, I know a guy who can repair your hole. Who? Me. What? <laughs> okay, yeah, let's do it. Y'all right. ready? You guys ready? All right. We are wrapping up our very first public event out here at the Desperado. And from up here, you actually can hear the band really, really well, which is super cool. I mean, imagine you're just up here, you rented out this room, which obviously is A plus rating. I mean, look, it's a five star room for sure. And you got this view looking down at the Guadalupe River and Willie Nelson is playing right there and you just get to sit on your balcony all by yourself watch the sun go down right over there listen to willie nelson down in the pasture freaking heaven on earth thank you to everyone who came out you guys are so awesome and this event went so well like so perfect it was so chill i just hung out here for two days with all you guys everyone was nice we had people from all over the u.s and several like five countries outside of the US. We had Netherlands, Norway, Belgium, Canada, 
There's, there's one more. England. There's a guy from England here. Thank you guys. There's probably more too. I'm probably forgetting some, but it's crazy. People came out here just to support. So huge thank you to the people who wanted to be part of our very first event out here at the Desperado. It means a ton to me and it was awesome that it just went so smoothly. Like everyone was chill, everyone was cool, everyone's happy, they're all just like meeting their neighbor and just hanging out with them, drinking a beer. So good. My plan for the rest of the night, I'm turning this camera off, saying goodbye to you guys, and I'm just gonna go enjoy our very first event. I'm gonna watch the Brett Mullins band, I'm gonna sit in the grass with my, my wet jeans on from playing in the Guadalupe because I forgot to bring a swimsuit, so I went in in the jeans, and we're just gonna chill and have the best freaking time at Booty Snapple Fest. Also, I wasn't recording, but Brett Mullins apparently watched my videos because he put Booty Snapple in one of his songs a second ago. It's pretty funny. Pretty Good job, Brett. That was great. I wish I could show you guys how happy I am. I'm so freaking excited. Thank you guys. Thank you guys for watching. All you guys who are just here in spirit too and rooting us on. Thank you. We have a huge task ahead of us with all this and all that and all that burned down building over there. But I'm up to the challenge and we got the demolition at our backs. We're unstoppable, man. Thank you so much. I love you. And I'll see you next time. Stay out of trouble tonight, would you? Maybe.